Ladies and gentlemen, welcome. It's been a while since I made a update video on this setup over here. But today is that day. I have now a dry circuit over here with this a uh, P channel MOSFET and some modification transformer over here, full bridge rectifier. I'm running the system on uh, about 16 volt DC and milliamp draw is around this meter over here. Uh, let's say 20 milliamps. The idea of this circuit is very simple. Um, push back some of the back EMF of the coils back to the source cap and also in between the uh, magnets where I'm pulsing you have like uh, half a sine wave over there so I'm trying to catch that both of them through the transformer but because the voltage of those are way too little I'm stepping them up a little bit and hopefully dump that in the cap also kind of like a self-sustained circuit self-driven, self-loop or whatnot. Here I have a big capacitor which is a um, 15 volt DC cap 25,000 UF microfarads I'm gonna remove the power so it runs on the what is in the capacitor it is already dropping it's now 14 volt DC and of course the momentum of this big rotor over here, which is built like a flywheel does help a little bit it is still pulsing I would say around 10 milliamps now maybe a little less so yeah it's not that bad next what I'm gonna do is the, uh, remove this uh, transform over here I put one with a uh, low resistant primary so I can push a little bit a little bit more current in the system and hopefully get it to spin faster and hopefully get more EMF out of it also yeah, we'll see, it's just a test setup, nothing special as usual still have in there around 10 volts in the cap, as you can see the cap is uh, nothing special, it's just a good quality cap 10 volts maybe still pulsing but you cannot see that on the 500 milliamp scale so yeah Okie dokie, hope you enjoyed it, and as always, thank you for watching.